service, honor, dedication, sacrifice. These inspirational words decorate the halls of firehouses all across our nation. Many times these words seem hollow, cliche, as if they're put up for decoration. On August 5th, we are reminded of the true severity of Solomon's, of our oath we take as firefighters as we enter the service. We witness the gravity and the true meaning of those words. Times like this, I'm reminded of a verse from the Gospel of John. No one has greater love than this, to lay down one's life for one's friend. Further reminded of words of our general president, Kelly, who said, God hasn't met us yet. We lay down on our lives for strangers. You might hold that in high regard. Brother Booker provided us with a profound example of service, honor, and dedication. In the halls of Casper College Fire Science Program, Evansville Firefighters, Cheyenne Firefighters, the Front Range Training Consortium, his legacy as a firefighter, an engineer, and a lieutenant will live on in the memories of his brother and sister firefighters, the skills of his former students, and the lives of the patients and citizens he served. Sacrifice, the last full measure of devotion, the highest price, the greatest cost. His final act doesn't seem fair. Affects not just Brother Booker, but his family too. So often in this profession, it falls to our families to make the sacrifice. To the Booker family, your sacrifice will never be forgotten. Next year, Aaron's name will be memorialized and engraved on our fallen firefighter memorial in Colorado Springs. He will join seven other brothers from the local 279 five other brothers from Wyoming, and over 8,637 brothers and sisters from the United States and Canada on the hollow black granite walls. His name will forever be preserved as a reminder to those who pass by of your sacrifice, the sacrifice of laying down one's life for strangers, and the sacrifice of laying down one's family member's life for others. Throughout the history of the fire service, the firefighter's life has been closely associated with the ringing of a bell. When the firefighter reported for his tour, it would be a ringing of the bell that would start it off. And throughout the day and night, each alarm was sounded by the ringing of a bell. And the firefighter would place his or her life in harm's way for the good of their fellow man. And when the fire was out and the alarm was over, the bell would ring three times three sets, signifying the end. And now, in honor of our brother, Aaron Booker, the bell will ring three times. All uniformed personnel, please rise. Booker, we honor you today. 
today. We thank you for your service. Rest easy, Booker. We've got it from here.